Hi friends, welcome back to my channel and a very special welcome if you're new here. My name is Jen. I'm a certified weight loss and nutrition coach and it's Saturday, so it's grocery haul day. And I have a massive haul for you from three stores. I did a huge Costco stock up. We have lots of new food finds, healthy foods, a little unhealthy foods. We got a little bit of everything. So if you're excited, give this video a big thumbs up. Subscribe if you're not, turn your bell on so you never miss a future video. Don't forget to check out the description box down below where you will find nutrition coaching. I do offer personalized to you macros and calories. Highly recommend. This is how I've lost 140 pounds and kept that weight off. As well as one-on-one -on -one coaching for accountability. If you want to chat with me, ask questions, I have one-on-one -on -one coaching as well. Links, discounts to my favorite things and my Facebook group. Definitely come and help definitely come join us over there because I have a special recipe for 4th of July that I'll be sharing exclusively in my Facebook group and over on Instagram. So make sure you're following me in both places. So let me turn you around and let's jump into this massive grocery haul. So here's my big stock up haul from Costco. I didn't, we didn't bring in our case of water, case of Diet Coke, case of Gatorade, zero. Troy's actually putting those away in the garage, but let me show you all the other good stuff we grabbed at Costco. So I took my husband with me, so he did pick out a few things. He wanted some more fruit snacks, so we picked up the ones from Mott's. These are his all-time favorite. I also did a restock of my face wash, of my makeup remover wipes. I use these quite a bit, especially when I'm filming for my beauty channel or just to take off skincare or makeup. They come in really, really handy. And the Kirkland brand, hands down, is my favorite. It's the wettest, so it works really, really well. I got a two pack of Listerine. This was actually on coupon for $10. That is a killer deal for these big bottles. And then we decided to go ahead and buy this big box. These are individual bowls of pre-cooked, ready-to-go white rice. So after Lola has chemo, she's usually sick for a couple days where she doesn't eat a lot of food. So we've been doing chicken, rice, and canned food, and I've been having having to make rice. And this is just easy. I can just divide one of these bowls out between her and Palmer. It'll just make it a lot easier. And then that way Troy doesn't have to make rice if he wants it as a side dish as well, because these are pre-cooked, ready to go. They were super affordable, less than $11 for, like I said, 12 bowls. That's less than a dollar a piece. Brushes for Troy. I use a Sonicare. He prefers just a regular toothbrush. My favorite yogurt in the whole world is the Chobani Zero Sugar. And this was such a great deal. I couldn't pass it up. I've been obsessed with my yogurt bowl like literally obsessed with it. So I've been having yogurt every single day. And then we needed some more Tide Pods for laundry. This is our go-to laundry detergent. We love it. And then Troy wanted some white bread. Spoiler alert, he didn't love the whole grain bread. I was wondering if he would, he didn't love it. So we decided to get white bread. We just chose a better option for him. So this is the Dave's Killer Bread White Done Right. $9 for two loaves, which is really good because I saw it at Sprouts for about $6 a loaf. So that was actually a really good deal. And I know that he'll eat white bread way more than he eats whole grain bread. And then this was a new thing that I saw and I decided to try these out. So these are no sugar company cups. So we have a dark chocolate peanut butter and this one I'm really excited about because you know I love mint anything. Dark chocolate and mint. So these are actually for keto which you guys know I don't do keto. However super low calorie 80 calories for the mint 8 grams of fats, only 7 carbohydrates, and 2 grams of protein. And then for the peanut butter one, it's actually 70 calories, 7 grams of fat, 9 carbohydrates, and 1 gram of protein. So I thought, really for a sweet treat, I wanted to try them out. They were less than $10. So still a really, really good deal. It says they're individual little serving packs. Actually, let's open them up and look at them. Oh, so here's what they look like. So they're little individual cups. So that's actually really good for portion control. So that's a nice sweet treat. I'm really excited for those. I also picked up a thing of Hillshire Farm lunch meat, the lower sodium, the turkey breast and ham. Troy wanted this. He's been on the sandwich kick lately and we like to sometimes make a cob salad and add some good lunch meat to our salad as well. So I grabbed that. Paper towels, Bounty was actually less expensive than the Kirkland brand because these are currently on coupon. So we grabbed those. A huge bag, which which Troy was really excited about of his Himalayan gold lesser evil popcorn. Y'all already know this is a staple in our house. We love it. And then I decided to buy honey. I still have a little bit of honey left from the small one that I bought, but this is just such a better deal at Costco. So I picked that up. I was really excited to see these. I've actually never seen these before. They're from the Just Bear brand, which I have the Just Bear chicken strips right now. And I love them. I actually like them better than the chicken nuggets, but they have these raw pre-cut boneless skinless chicken breast pieces. This entire 
entire bag, which is four pounds was $10. I thought that was an amazing deal. And it said you can literally go from freezer to skillet in 10 minutes. So I thought, this would be a really easy lunch or dinner and a really good way to get in protein, pretty much ready to go for you. So 23 grams of protein and 100 calories. So huge bang for your protein buck. Back here behind all my other goodies is toilet paper, another thing we always get at Costco. We did grab another big thing of Windex. This is also an amazing deal right now. I think it's $8, so it's really, really good for the big refill and then a full-size Windex. Troy got the four bean salad. He likes this. It actually reminds me a lot of my dad. When I was a kid, We, my dad would get this every time we went to Costco. This Paisley Farm brand, it's been at Costco forever. It was his favorite four bean salad. I'm not a fan, so I won't be eating these, but this was a really good deal. I think it was about $8 for two jars. And then we have string cheese right now. We have the Frigo brand. It's not my favorite. This is my favorite. The Organic Valley Stringles. I just grabbed them because I eat string cheese pretty much every day, and I will definitely pick these over the Frigo. Can I help you? I have something for you when I'm done. We'll give it to you when we're done, okay? And then the Kirkland brand of the scent beads, we use these in our laundry. This one smells so good. It's lavender vanilla. It was only $10. And the Downy brand is like $18. So we got it. We thought we would try it out, see if we like it as much as the Downy. And then I picked up Troy's Omeprazole, which is the acid reducer. He takes that every day. And then he also chose the Cello brand variety pack cheese. This is actually really good. You get cheddar, Jarlsberg Swiss, creamy Havarti, and Dutch Gouda all in a pack. Pre-cut up, perfect size for crackers, and who doesn't love a good cheese and cracker? I did get some treats for the dogs. These were on coupon. We've had these before. My dogs really like them. They're little chewy lamb sticks. And then I did grab a big thing of olive oil. I was hoping that they had the Chosen Foods avocado oil, and they did, but it was a huge container. I mean, it would take me years to go through it. And it was like $22, and I wanna say this was 13. So I just grabbed olive oil. I just like to have a healthy oil on hand. I've been really into making my own vinaigrette for salad, so I've been going through oil a little bit quicker. And then I decided to get these dried strawberries, soft and juicy. 90 calories for an ounce of these. I just like having dried fruit. It's convenient, especially if I'm making homemade trail mix or just want to take something with me on the go. And then we did grab a little bit of fruit. So we got some green grapes. This is what Troy wanted. And then I got some more raspberries. That's honestly one of my favorite fruits. So that is everything that we picked up, our big stock up haul from Costco. Let's go ahead and jump into the rest of our groceries for the week. So the rest of my haul this week came from both Walmart and Sprout. So like I said, I have a pretty massive haul for you. So let me show you what I picked up. First, let's go ahead and start at Walmart. That's gonna be the smallest haul from these two stores. I did pick up a case of Diet Coke that is in the garage. Two gallons of 1% milk for Troy for his cereal, as well as just for milk throughout the week. I did grab some more of the real bacon bits because we are out. We have been on a big salad kick, so we've been going through these rather quickly. We were out of shredded cheese altogether, so I did pick up some light Fiesta blend and then some Colby Jack for Troy for salads quesadillas, breakfast sandwiches. He uses a lot of shredded cheese. And then I also grabbed two containers of the ready rice that you just throw in the microwave for 90 seconds. This has been a really easy side for us for lunch and dinners. I just have a really small amount and then Troy eats the rest, but it's just so convenient and easy. So I did the rice peel off and then I did the roasted chicken. I also picked up a box of Rice Krispies because I have a really good meal prep coming for you guys this next week. High protein, high protein meal prep and I needed Rice Krispies for that. My favorite gravy for my KFC bowls. I was thinking I may make those this week and I've been out of gravy. I just like to have this on hand. I also picked up some salsa. Fourth of July, Troy and I are going to order pizza and then I'm going to make a fruit pizza, which I'm going to show you what I picked up for that. My plan is to share the recipe in my Facebook group and on Instagram. So make sure you follow me in both of those places. They are both linked down below and we're going to do chips, salsa, and guac as a appetizer. So I picked up some salsa. I love this one from Walmart. Tostada shells. This is for my lunch meal prep. I also needed some black beans for my lunch meal prep. We were out of Parmesan cheese altogether, so I picked up a fresh shredded Parmesan. Now for the fruit pizza, you need cream cheese, so I did two of the one-third less fat 
cream cheese. And then I wanted the cookie, sugar cookie roll, and they didn't have it at Walmart. So these are the little squares. I'm just gonna mash them all together because that's the crust of the pizza. It is such a good, delicious, fresh 4th of July or really summer dessert. So again, make sure you're in my Facebook group and you follow me on Instagram because I plan on sharing the recipe there. Now moving over to Sprouts, Troy asked for blue cheese dressing. I've never tried this brand, but it was on sale. Normally $6 for $3.50, I believe. This is the Toby's blue cheese dressing and dip. He wanted a blue cheese dressing for salads. And then I did pick up shredded chicken. I've been giving this to Lola after chemo with rice. I got that sticky rice at Costco and I've been mixing that together for her with some canned food. She needs to get her calories in because she keeps losing weight and she doesn't always feel good after chemo and she doesn't need her kibble. So this has been really just a lifesaver for us. And then I am planning on making homemade trail mix. I love homemade trail mix. It's one of my favorite things. I think what we'll do is make this in Wednesdays what I eat in a day. So again, subscribe, turn your bell on so you don't miss it. I did pick up some of my dried mango. I love having this as just a, a snack. I count this to zero points. It has the same macros as regular fresh mango. And then for the trail mix this time, I grabbed some dried diced up pineapple some raw almonds and some pumpkin seeds. And then I have some candied pecans from Imperfect Foods and some freeze dried blueberries. And I'm gonna make a granola. So stay tuned for Wednesdays, what I eat in a day, we'll make that together. And then late July products were buy one, get one free at Sprout. So I've never tried this, but hello, Mexican street corn tortilla chips. Doesn't that sound so good? So I can't wait to try those. And then I did get the sea salt and lime for the guac and salsa for 4th of July. Now I bought this last time I went to Sprouts and I bought the chocolate peanut butter one and I'm obsessed with it. Like it's so good. And it was still there for $2.99, which is an incredible deal. So this time I grabbed maple pecan. This is just a granola. Nice clean ingredients. I'd love to put this on my yogurt bowls. I did pick up another one of my favorite little meat sticks. These are the Vermont Uncured Turkey Pepperoni. I leave these in my purse for whenever I need a snack, something filled with protein on the go. And I ate the one that was in my purse. So I bought another one to toss in for backup. And then I got some chicken breast for a couple of recipes this next week. This is the no antibiotic, boneless, skinless chicken breast. It was a really good deal. It was 11 bucks. And I thought it with that was Excellent, $3.99 a pound right now at Sprouts. And then everything else I picked up is produce. So a big, huge bag of broccoli for a dinner recipe. I also grabbed a lot of fruit for the fruit pizza. I always do red and blue fruit, and then the frosting with the cream cheese is white. So it's like a red, white, and blue pizza. So I grab blueberries, and whatever's left over, we just eat throughout the week. Strawberries blackberries and raspberries. That's gonna be our red, white, and blue for our fruit pizza. And then they had mango chunks on sale for $2.50, so about half off. I love mango on salad, and I'm going to have a salad for lunch today, my mango strawberry salad. I made in last week's meal prep, obsessed with that, so I grabbed some more mango. Little cherry tomatoes, this is for a dinner recipe. Avocados for homemade guac. Shredded lettuce for my lunch meal prep. Now I wanted shredded romaine, but it did not look very good at Sprouts. So I just went ahead and went with regular shredded lettuce, a bell pepper for a dinner recipe, cilantro for a recipe, and then I did pick up some organic baby carrots for snacking and for salads. So that is everything I picked up for the week from Costco, Walmart, and Sprouts. Let's jump into what's for dinner and what you'll see in Monday's meal prep. So here is what is on my menu for dinners and meal prep. So, so today, Saturday is out for dinner. Tomorrow, Sunday, we're doing salads to finish up all the greens in the fridge. Monday, I'm doing a broccoli cheese stuffed chicken breast. Stay tuned for that. That'll be in Wednesday's What I Eat in a Day. We have a couple leftover nights and then I'm doing a pasta with pesto on Thursday. And then for meal prep this week, I'm making chia pudding, which I'm super, super excited about. I'm also doing a protein rice crispy treat, hence why I bought the rice krispies. And then for breakfast this, or for lunch this week, I'm doing chicken tostadas. So I have some really good high protein recipes for you in Monday's meal prep. Thank you for joining me for another massive haul. I hope you enjoyed seeing everything I picked up from Costco, Walmart, and Sprouts. We are set, we are stocked up, we are ready for a successful, healthy week. And if you enjoyed the video, give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe if you're not, make sure you're in my Facebook group and follow me on Instagram for that special dessert pizza recipe. It's really good. We've made it every single 4th of July and we love it. So definitely stay tuned for that. And of course, check out the description box for nutrition coaching, links and discounts to my favorite things, and the link to my Facebook group and Instagram. Happy Saturday, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.